Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Um, today we're going to be starting something a little bit different. This is going to be a challenge run, and the name of this challenge is 42 Days in Each Region Challenge. Um, this is a challenge I made a few months ago, and forces you to stay in each of the Long Dark's 12 regions for 42 days. So what's going to happen is, we're going to start in Desolation Point, this is going to be on Interloper. I've tested this on Stalker, made it to Coastal Highway, and got bored. Um, so for Interloper, I think um, it's going to present a much more of a challenge for us, much more of a grind. Um, and I think that's what we're looking for. So we're going to start in Desolation Point on day one, obviously. By day 42, we're going to want to hit the road for Coastal Highway. How transition caves and transition regions are going to work, um, that's going to be kind of up to us as we go. Maybe give us 24 hours per um, region, transition, you know, little area, but we'll see. So you can see the map. You follow the red line through Coastal Highway, stay another 42 days. Then we um, take Cinder Hills Coal Mine up to Pleasant Valley, stay another 42 days, and then Timberwolf, 42 days, Ash Canyon, then once the 42 days in Ash Canyon are up, we backtrack through Timberwolf and into Black Rock. And then same from Black Rock to Mystery Lake. Got to go through the Keeper's Passes and Pleasant Valley. Um, and yeah, so if you follow the line, um, it takes you through Bleak Inlet, the Muskeg again. We hit Broken Railroad. We come back through Muskeg, go all the way up Mountain Town. Um, and then we end in Hushed River Valley. Now, one of your questions may be, why 42 days? Well, the math actually comes out to do 42 days times 12, the 12 main regions of the Long Dark. Um, it comes out to approximately 504 um, days. So this challenge really is designed to get you to the 500 day mark, right? That will to live achievement. Um, and I thought, no better way to end it in the Hushed River Valley at peak. Um, that's kind of what I see. So I think without really much further talking, um, we're going to get right into it. This is going to be a really difficult challenge, especially it was really difficult on Stalker starting in Desolation Point. Um, so I can imagine how difficult it's going to be um, an interloper, right? Because the food, food's going to be tough. Do we ration the food? Do we not ration the food? I guess that's a question for when we get into the game. So um, I'm going to keep loading up these um, new worlds and see if I can get a Desolation Point spawn. I have a Desolation Point spawn. I will cut back. Um, and yeah, wish me luck. Awesome guys, so we got our desolation point spawn. So yeah, let's start this 42 days. So first order of business, definitely. Um, we're gonna make our way to Hibernia and see if we can get those matches. You know, uh, that's usually what you do in an interloper run. Now it's very unlike me to be cutting um, any gameplay in the long dark. I feel like bringing you guys along the journey is really part of the experience so what i'm gonna do oh that's kind of scared me what we're gonna do is not cut um you know besides me looking for regions which i got uh desolation point on the second try uh, first try was timberwolf mountain and now we finally got it we're looking for so um reason i wanted to do straight on interloper and not custom um settings because i know with custom i literally could have just um, spawned in in Desolation Point was because I wanted the achievements to stay on. In custom, you do not get achievements. So, um, I felt like I think the 500 days achievement in this mode was pretty important. So, that's my justification for um, trying straight on Interloper. Crap metal, huh? Interesting. Hey, I found this on my last run. Awesome. Anything for us? Nothing. 
I'm super excited for this challenge. I really am. Um, I did it on Stalker about a month or two ago. Really, really fun. So, yeah, really um, looking forward to this. Any coal right here? Yes. Awesome. Um, we also do want a heavy hammer. If we can't have a heavy hammer, is what it is, but, you know, always preferable in these situations. Uh, it doesn't look like much of anything's going on here. Nope, nothing. We do kind of want to move um, with some purpose because our our uh, warmth is going down steadily. So something we kind of want to keep an eye on. Uh, usually there's stuff in this stairs for us. Let's see. Um, yeah, need to do so. Uh, okay, we have another book. That'll be useful in our... Essentially, um, you literally essentially pass time near towards the end of the 42 days, but again, that was when I was in Stalker. So I'm not too sure how this interlope is going to play out. Um, I'm nonetheless excited to find out. Here are the bears. Bears not here. Good pose too, right? I mean, that's another thing we gotta look for. You know? Because if we don't have good clothes, um, it's gonna make our life much harder. And also not finding the hacksaw is gonna make our life a lot harder as well. So, let's just hope we get a little lucky here. That time we got lucky. I'm just going to drop the scrap here. We're not going to need it um, where we're going. So, we'll get to know this region very well. I need um, to find some place to escape this cold. Yeah, the real thing I don't like about on this interloper is the fact that the character talks. Not a big fan of voice monologue in this game, but it is what it is. Sometimes there's a can of dog food here. Famous can, but not here today. We're gonna start taking damage soon. It is fine. It is interloper. Oh. Condition does come back. But if you've been following my channel for a little bit, um, you may have noticed that I've posted a few runs that I have Damn. since freezing it's taken down not taken down but i've since kind of ended them um that's because i wanted to kind of warm up the long dark if you will i got the long dark on pc a little while ago um actually just recently really um but i wanted to just kind of warm up to it i didn't want to hop into a challenge right away but you know 42 days is something i've really wanted to be doing so I think now that, ooh, they could find it. Now that I'm warmed up, I think we can kind of start this challenge. It's essentially what I am trying to say. Oh. So yeah, very excited for this. It's gonna be a lot of fun, I think. Had a lot of fun doing it in Stalker, so. Leather shoes, really. Oh, really? Wow. All right. Well, point one of a degree is point one of a degree. Really get upset. You know the pry bar also, right? I mean, so the rules for this run. Um, obviously it is forty-two days in each region, so we're not allowed to leave each region. And the same goes for once you leave a region. You cannot come back. I'm so you know, cold. Kind of the. Just want to lay down for a bit. 
the no backs use um, rule. You've heard of that in anything? Kind of what we're going to be playing. You know, once we leave, uh, no coming back. So that, that should make it a lot more fun and challenging. So always for that, definitely. Always up for the challenge. Okay. It's going to be cold in here. It usually always is. So we need to be careful at least a little bit. Yeah. It's cold, but... The end of the world. Hope nobody needs this anymore. I'm going to actually take it, you know. Isolation point. Well, if you're in a region for a while, you're going to want at least some stuff. So I usually don't take the antiseptic, but we're going to today. All right. Usually nothing in these filing cabinets, but I have found some soda. So let's see if it comes true this time around. I'll take the tinder. Hey, that's good. Any food early on is good news. Anything. So, um, yes, back to the rules. So yeah, no backsies. Once you leave a region, you're not gonna come out. Uh, or come back in, I should say. Now, in terms of the transition regions, not really sure how we're gonna work the ruling on them. Maybe we give ourselves a day, maybe a day and a half to get through a region or something. We can set a goal when the time comes, but you know, this we're gonna want to I'm gonna want to definitely get that figured out. I have a lot of thinking time too. We got a lot of time to do that. 42 days, you know. So it should be should be interesting. Really excited to see where this where this uh, run goes. I think we're gonna want to start a fire as well with our brand new matches that we have found. Is there a hacksaw? Because a hacksaw would be very nice. You're joking, right? No tool at all? Really? I think this is just a joke. I think they're somewhere. Come on, are you serious? No way. There's no tool anywhere on these racks? What? How is that even... Why is that even allowed? Why is that allowed? Oh my gosh. I don't think I've ever been in this like region and I've not found tools there. That's a little wild to me. I don't know. Um, let's go ahead and make our tender. I just want to make one. I don't want to take a ton of damage. And a bedroll too, right? I mean, you got to find that. There's no tools there. There has to be a bedroll. I don't make the rules, there just has to be. Come on. Come on. We got screwed with the tool. At least we could do is get a fire first try. There we go. Good to see. Good to see. Okay. Um no. Let's unload. You know, do I put a coal? Oh, the coal reminds me too. Do we count the transition mine between desolation and crumbling as desolation point? You know, I've really been thinking about that. Do we count it or not? And I'm going to say we don't. I'm going to say we have to stay within the bounds of desolation point, meaning no leaving desolation, which also means no leaving or transition caves. That's what I would like to kind of think of it as. Let me know what you guys think of the rules so far, especially that one in the comments. Um, if you're watching, because I would like to get your feedback on it. Um, definitely, because you guys are the people watching. So you'll be watching my moves and such. Oh, is there no box there? Okay, there's no need to do all this. 
Yeah, we gotta see if there is, however, a bedroll. I don't think there is. This isn't a really famous, like, great bedroll spawn. Yeah, I didn't really say anything. Um, I was just kind of thinking out loud. Definitely was not thinking that. Um, yeah. Glad we found that. Really. Um, that makes our lives a ton easier, actually. Because I think... As far as I'm aware, there's two spawns for a bedroll in Desolation Point. Um, you're going to be looking at Stone Church and um, this place. So, really good we found one because I wasn't trying to um, sleep with that one. Because you can't sleep with that one, so. Ooh. Yeah, we'll add a coal. Give us an hour. We'll break down one of these crates as well. But, um, let's just keep kind of searching this out. I'd like to find a hacksaw. Hey! More matches, the better. I mean, matches is going to be the that one thing where you're going to want as many as possible. Oh, that's a good thing. Oh, it's a beautiful thing. What have we here? I would like a hacksaw though. You know? I don't know if there's any other hacksaw spawns in this region. Besides you're right there, so I don't know. We'll have to find out the hard way, I suppose. But even that's you know, that's okay. Off. Not gonna go that way. Too slow for me. But yeah, I hope you guys like the challenge idea um i don't know how i got this idea i don't know how i thought of it, it kind of came to mind one day and i thought it'd be really cool to try to do that i did test it in stalker like i said earlier and you know as you would in stalker it, you get overwhelmed with food and it just doesn't really become a challenge anymore that's why I stopped, so we'll see if Interloper is the same hey, Kind of doubting it. But, you never know. Uh, am I gonna get stuck? Sometimes there's a backpack ah. back here. Is it there today? Yeah, the, see the backpack laying there? I don't know if you even get to it from here without getting stuck in the terrain, which is... Not what we're really trying to do, to be honest. Should be breaking down those boxes, though, for, for wood. Should really be doing that, actually. Uh, we will add on another coal. We're going to go through that mine and get a, uh, a coal respawn going here pretty soon. Let's take an hour of this. Great. Oh, whoops. It's good to go. Ooh, these. Uh, those are a little bit too long. For an hour, any hour box, the water's likely gonna boil off, but I'm not too insane about it. Not too worried. Where is this fire? There we go. 36. Hey, as well. There we go. Alright. I'm gonna take a torch. Always important. Team minutes, eh? Okay, we can put another reclaimed on. Seventeen till boil. Okay, take another one of those. 
Now, do we go outside and kind of see what's what? Oh, we didn't. We never searched this. Hey, more reading material. Always open to that. Uh, looks like a little bit of an aurora going on. I'm gonna need to eat soon. Um, definitely, so. Not too thrilled about it, not gonna lie. But, looks like it is what it is. So. Oh, no aurora. Not yet, anyway. We gotta be careful of a wolf here. He does like to hang out around here. Ooh, I love the loons. Loons are always very pretty. Always a little tedious, that spot. Not a huge fan of it, but... We're here. Uh, oh, very nice. There's a nice free bed here, so that's good. That 100% torch, though. Very nice. Anything else here? Another book would be cool. Really? Wow. Big ol' nothing. It's uh, interesting. But, uh, not surprising. Yeah, so I think what we do is put that out. Wow, it is dark. That's not too bad, actually. Uh, where was its crate? Come on. Where was the crate? Leave trailer, then it's gotta be down here and then here. Is it just not today? Did it move on me? There we go. Break that down. We're looking at for temperature in here. 33, just over. You like to see it. I'm gonna take some of those as well. And then we'll sleep as well. Let's. I need to find food. You know, one thing that I've been contemplating is do we go for that well fed bonus? You know, do we do that? Or do we starve? Kind of recover the condition later. I think because we're in such tight kind of error. You know, we're, we're in a very tight situation, so I think what we do is we just starve. And we'll recover the condition sleeping sometimes. I really think that's kind of how it, it's going to go. So we'll sleep full like 7-8 hours and let that hunger kind of do its thing. Let's first check if we have any maintenance activities. Because there is a few things we can tear down and such. Let's start with this. A nice 10 minutes. Very nice. Um, the shoes are way too long. An hour, hour and a half. Um, let us do the tinder. Can't have enough tinder early game. Awesome. Bandages, you know? Not sure about bandages. You know, let's sleep for seven. Um, you know, hunger. We'll just eat it. We'll eat it off, I guess, later. It's some bright in here, wow. Very pretty. My stomach feels like an empty pit. Yeah, it that 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 happens. That does happen.
Very cool. Um, so now would be a time to do those shoes, right? Because... Yeah, that would definitely be a now thing. You know sewing kits, right? So sewing kits, fishing tackle, all that stuff's going to be important. Because... We do not have sewing kits. Probably won't find one here in Desolation. You know, knowing the odds. So, that's just something to keep in mind. May not be able to repair our clothes very much. Now, that'll be different in Coastal Highway. Coastal Highway is such a big region for, you know, you'll find everything there. Very plentiful, which is good. Let's pick us up to full again. Uh, yeah, let's let's take a peek outside, see what's going on. Baiting Aurora. Very, very cool though. But you best believe it's cold. Yeah, it's a little chilly. Looking at in here, 11, could be worse definitely. Now this area, famously bad. Famously just, just badness. I hate this area very much. Not really sure where the bear is either. It'll be okay, just have to take our time. Cool over there, the lighthouse. Always really cool. Okay, there's a wolf right over there. <coughs> Chuck a rock that way, see? You can draw him. Good, we did. I don't know if you heard that. Um car door, but it's fine. Get out while he's doing that. My fingers feel numb. Going kit? Not bad. Take it. Looks like I made it through another night. I wouldn't bet on that quite yet. We're not in the clear. All right, any stretch of the imagination, we are not in the clear, so. <laughs> really kind of hoping is just down there and won't bother me. We're okay, but you really never know. I do apologize too if the audio is quiet on my end in my mic. I am currently recording from my college dorm room. <laughs> uh, and it's kind of late at night, so I do have to be somewhat considerate of people around me. Okay, this I do not count as outside desolation point. This is kind of a mine inside of, you know, inside of desolation, so I don't know. I don't count it. We don't have any light sources, do we? The negative. Um, why don't we light up our 22 percenter? Not really too worried about burning through matches at the moment. I think just right now the priority is coal. Um, gonna want a lot of coal early game, as you would want to, you know. So should be a good amount though. 
Oh, nice. More matches. Very match-rich region on some spawns, you know? Some spawns you can find, you know, three, four packs of matches in a region. Other spawns, you know, you're looking for a way to make water, right? I guess it's all just luck. It is just luck, really. What are we looking at for temp? 36. Should be warming up fairly quick. Temperature should get out of the red soon. Now, do we have um possible rybar spawn in here? That would be good. The lockers in the lighthouse. Um, that would be really nice. Forgot this usually is a short mine. Not usually is, it is a short mine. Um, ah, you know. Tough. If you don't find a pry bar in Desolation, we will never get to open those lockers, you know? So, something to think about, I suppose. So, I am inclined to keep this fire going. I think we do that, to be honest. So, we do have a wolf encounter. But how much coal did we grab on that? Hmm. We're still well underweight. Something I like. Go up to the stone church. And we can vent our fire there. These things, you know. Ah, uh, that's a carcass. Die if I don't warm up soon. Yeah, that's a carcass. Um, that looks good to me. I think I'm gonna put a coal on it. Definitely. I want to harvest this guy. Come we, on. Have, we do have to wait. Until he's fifty percent melted, do that. It worked. So let's put on two coal. Definitely. Start some water as well. Have to task here a little bit. Um, gotta wait anyway for a man to thaw. So. Make some use out of it, huh? 76%. Oh, come on. I'm afraid we'll overstay our welcome. The weather. Definitely gonna eat this stuff right away. Um, it was not obvious. And I think we're gonna take the deer pelt as well. Deer um, hide. Definitely. Gonna want that for sure. You know, 42 days, that thing will be cured in time. So. We'll get a little condition recovery back. However, not a ton. It is, right? Okay. Let's go ahead and do that. Oh, Why is it two down? It wasn't even moving. It does that weird glitch where if you move and then press it, it still does two down. You have to wait. Stop. Um. And this is a nice warm fire. What are we looking at for daytime? Okay. I think what we do is. Actually, you know what? Let's take this. 
Yeah, let's take that. Then we can move it to the church. Church is just better shelter overall. And you have the bunnies too. The bunnies are edible, obviously. So we have a way to cook them. All right, you know, it's gonna be a little bit of a grind today. At least for a few weeks in game. But I don't know what we signed up for. Dressing later. There's another bedroll in here, that'd be kind of funny. That yeah, doesn't look like it right now. Yeah, let's take a chance with that cedar wood. Come on. Yeah, we got it. Let's go. Awesome. All right. Uh, awkward little piece, but it's fine. Do a coal as well on it, but. We don't really want to burn through our coal. Because we have burned. But I do think it is worth it in this case, so. Just one on. Yeah, let's. No, let's do. Some more tinder. I want to grab those bunnies outside too. But we gotta do it really as. Kind of quiet as possible, I guess you could say. Because of the wolves nearby. You can't let these guys run either. They run. Um, we're not going to get them. I would like to kind of just... The wolf car. Let's just kind of lure them away. There's many. I think they're gonna be coming up pretty soon. What? Whoa, 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 hey. Let it relax outside. Go boiled. Hour to do this guy. Do it. Never been so hungry in my life. Just like with the deer, we're gonna take his pelt. Um, most definitely. We were clean. Um. Might even go ahead and try to grab another. Not sure what the situation's like with the wolf. I don't know if one came up behind me. Yeah, here he is. A stick as well. Oh, don't go behind the mound. Mm. Ah, dang it. Let's hope he doesn't run into a wolf. No? <laughs> but we gotta do you quick. Come on. 
There you go. Say I heard footsteps, but I don't know. Um, so let's head and grab. We do a rabbit pelt as well. Uh, scratch that. We do not do a rabbit pelt as well. We're gonna do it eventually, though. We want the sticks out there. Look at this, guys, though. The food goes by so quick. It does go by. It, you know, the food. The pelts, however, shall take. Oh, let's do 46 minutes. That'll bring us right to where we need to be. Come on. Satisfied with that, let's head on out. What's our weight looking like? Wind looks strong, but doesn't look overwhelming. I'm curious to see if that moves. Um, it's on the bridge as well. But I can live without not knowing. We can out. Have to go. Is the moose on the bridge? I really actually hope it's not on the Because I think instead of going to the lighthouse right I want to go harvest that I could deer eat below. Anything. It does look like there's a deer below um, that waterfall is. Oh. That. No moose. Let's go. That's really good news for us. Is this a deer down here? It is a deer. Rabbit's here as well. Um, something to think about. Let's just Let's head down now. A little steep. <laughs> Made it though. Oh.
Nice feather spawn though. Do you like putting a fire in here? That's right. It's a nice birch over there. Too bad we don't have a hacksaw. That did it. I'm gonna feed this one sticks. Meantime, not ready yet. Let's be smart. Hold around. Always good to have. Okay. All right. Good maintenance, maintenance activities going on. Very nice. Little weather coming in. Might tuck into the rake if we have to, but not a big deal. Too bad. What a shame. What a shame. Fortunate, but what it is. Fifteen minutes out of this. Another fifteen minutes. Another 15 minutes. Be good. The point three. Every piece matters. Awesome. The whole thing will take us up. Alright. Not a bad dart so far here in Desolation Point. I do have to apologize for being quiet. I am trying to somewhat concentrate. Um, just because kind of the beginning has to be at least a little perfect, right? So. Can't be making errors. I'm also going to take the pelt. Definitely going to be taking the pelt, as a matter of fact, so. Um. Guess we'll do that now. The sun's setting. It's going to get a lot colder soon. some more torches, I think. Come on, come on. I think the last lap were... I think I do want one more. Yeah, okay, I'm satisfied. Um, lighthouse? Or right and... I'm gonna say we do lighthouse. Oh, guys. 
That had a pry bar on him. Let's go. Awesome. I know you guys are yelling at me, probably, but I just missed. So let me do the honors and take that. Really? There we go. Yeah. So keep the lamp burning. Be sneaky. Placement, but can't fool me. Actually, you can, but you know. Anyway. Yeah. And I'm been in the lighthouse, definitely. Move with some purpose here. As far as I know, I do not think there's any way of getting up there. On the back side, there is. But. Not sure about the front side here, but we'll try. I think. If we can get up some of this. I'm not a huge fan about trying to break an ankle. If we can pull our way up. Just a little step up. Asking for a leg break, but... About to go to bed anyway, so... Come on. Oh, guys. Nice. I think we just found a way up. The lighthouse. Really good, actually. Okay. Let's... First of all... Drop that, sub it with this. I have spoke a little too soon. We're good. Wow. I can't believe that worked. That was awesome. Um, any guy with a scarf down here? No, sir. So I'm gonna have to go back into the mine and get one locker that was locked. You know? So, do that. I'm gonna have to leave something behind. I think we're okay for now. I don't think we're gonna store this fire. I think we're just gonna let it go. message, I guess. Good stuff here. Usually always nice stuff in the world. <coughs> Don't fall down. What's our weight looking like? Okay, so yeah, we are truly overweight. Um. No. I'll be hungry later. A lot of stuff. I'm gonna hold on to that too for a little bit. See what's in me. Come on, be something good. Oh, of course. Whatever. Okay, let's just check up here. I know there's nothing, but food anyway. Yeah, if there's nothing up here, there's usually nothing around. This here. But we'll check for completionness. Very cool. A little interior. Yeah, though. Um, time to go to bed. Try to recover at least. Uh, hey! Alright. I'm not going to use that now, though. But. Okay, let's get this maintenance done first.
think we get rid of this one as well. And this one. Awesome. All right. So make more tinder. All right. Um, let's craft some just in case. Jeez. Cold in here, huh? Yeah. Rather chilly. Yeah, we're not really terribly overweight, actually. Not as much as I thought we were. Not sure why I feel so tired. Drop all these, definitely. And let's remember to pick them up. <laughs> um, yeah, let's... Put, put in seven. We'll wake up hungry, but that's okay. Um, alright. More of that. Oh, fuck up, Mike. Power can do yeah, okay, we, we can need start to eat starting. soon. Okay, that'll take us to full. Alright, guys. Um, it looks like we're up to time here, but, you know, good start, definitely, to this run, this challenge. Um, you know, from here on out... Never thought I'd be dying from starvation. From here on out, it's gonna be a little dicey, definitely. Um, we're gonna feel the crunch, but nothing we can't handle if we go slow, um, take our time, make some snares, do all that good stuff. So, um, yeah, if you made it this far, thank you for watching, and I hope to see you in the next episode.